Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we've got a mini guide for the Insight Terminus Grandmaster Nightfall which will hopefully get some of you that Conqueror title. Let's get him! So when you start you want to make your way to the entrance tunnel. From here there will be a champion that despawns with a little damage. Finish him off from range before moving into the next room, clearing out the enemies. A second barrier champion will spawn. There is a third barrier champion in this section, but be sure to clear out the low health enemies first. Once that's killed, make your way into the next section and defeat all the Cabal. There is a Colossus barrier champion here which you can finish with range and or your super. Finish the remaining enemies safely from range before moving into the next section, just watch out for the onrushing goblins. If you shoot the boss here before getting too close, then you avoid his stomp attack. Stand on the portal and kill the gladiator and war beasts, followed by the two unstoppable champions. Here again we use supers and heavies and run around the room to avoid damage, using mods to stun or a permanent this night stuff build like I'm using. Go through the portal and finish off the low health enemies first. This makes it easy to sustain focus fire on the champions. Shoot the boss again to trigger the enemy spawn and the next phase in this encounter. Again, kill the low health enemies first, followed by focus fire on the champions. Once you've killed the unstoppable champion, pick up the orb and deposit on the other side of the room. More barrier champions will spawn and I find it easiest to simply make your way back to the entrance and set up a series of 1v1s with each of the champions to reduce incoming damage. Finish off all three barrier champions followed by the unstoppable champion to release the second and final orb. Here I show how easy it is to deposit the orb with the Night Stalker build, avoiding all damage by switching between Smoke Bomb and Dodge. I use 6th Coyote, which provides two Dodge charges and can be used to recharge your Smoke Bomb completely when dodging near enemies. From here you can go straight through the tunnel or go back and finish off the remaining champions if you want the platinum. Make your way through a series of tunnels, double jumping in places to avoid fall damage. You're now in the boss room. Shooting the enemies in the middle starts the encounter. Just let the joining allies message appear and it'll teleport you to the encounter. Stand together on the portal in front of you and focus fire the initial wave of enemies to avoid being overwhelmed. Switch fire to the boss when he becomes available and burn him down to 50% to commence the second phase of this encounter. He does shoot a volley of void that trails on the floor and explodes at the end, so avoid that. Here you want to keep damaging the boss while avoiding enemy fire. Sometimes this happens. But that's why we use the Night Stalker build, for this exact reason. Pick up your teammates and go again. Damaging the boss to 50% makes him immune and spawns three portals. This is the second phase. The best strategy for this was to have a Night Stalker stay invisible in the portals until they cleared while your teammates fought away from the portals to reduce enemies straying into the portal that you're trying to capture. Once all three portals are clear, simply focus back on the boss while clearing enemies to provide breathing room. TLDR, shoot stuff and stay alive. I hope you enjoyed the video, enough to leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.